Today I'm going to read Away Went the Farmer's Hat. Mandy opens a word window. Guess what she reads? A farmer was in his field one day, and the wind blew the farmer's hat off his head. Away went the hat, up and around and down, on a horse's head. What a fine hat, the horse said. The horse wore the hat, but not for long. The wind blew the hat off his head, too. The hat went up and around and down on a pig's head. What a fine hat, the pig said. The pig wore the hat, but not for long. The wind blew the hat off her head, up and around and down on a cow's head. What a fine hat, the cow said. The cow wore the hat, but not for long. The wind blew the hat off her head, and up and around and down on a goat's head. What a fine hat, the goat said. The goat wore the hat, but not for long. The wind blew the hat off her head. The hat went up and around and down to a stream. What a fine boat, a little duck said. The duck floated along in the hat until she came to a waterfall. Down went the hat, down and around, and into the high grass. A rabbit came by. My, what a fine nest for my babies, said rabbit. The baby rabbit stayed in the farmer's hat, but not for long. They hopped away one by one until the hat was empty. Then the wind blew the hat into the air and up and around and down. Just then, a bird flew by. My, what a fine nest for my baby birds, said the bird. The baby birds stayed in the farmer's hat, but not for long. One by one, they flew away. A little squirrel came by. My, what a fine nest for my baby squirrels, she said. The baby squirrels stayed in the hat, but not for long. One by one, they climbed out of the hat and ran down the tree. Now that the hat was empty and all the leaves were off the trees, and... Who came riding by but the farmer on his horse? My hat in a tree? How can that be? asked the farmer. He pulled it down and held it on his head the whole way home. His wife tied two strings to his hat. These, she said, will keep the hat on your head where it belongs. The end.